empty lots and signs of no trespassing. Security Square Mall has far passed as a welcome spot in town. You could pretty much get any outfit that you wanted at this store. Um, they had an arcade here, movie theater. Um, it was a it was a jumping mall. <laughs> Randallstown NAACP President Ryan Coleman has memories here and wants to bring them back. We actually heard that uh, Sears, which actually left, is is looking to possibly become a warehouse. Um, and so, uh, with the decline of the mall, this was kind of the time to say, hey, we need to do something about it. Doing that something starts first with a 12 person task force of state and local leaders and backed by County Executive Johnny Oshesky. And now with the task force assembled, the Coleman says the next step is rounding up all the owners and interested stakeholders and doing what he calls the real work. The real work starts ground up, removing trash and growing shrubs from the surrounding pad sites. Then working with the businesses still here to find what could come next. Next. Restaurants, maybe some uh, apartments, senior citizen home, um, a lot of different things right here in the mall. I think it has a lot of, as you see, a lot of the different acreage here. With a prime location near 695 and remnants of the old Lively Mall, Coleman says there's potential to helping communities in Woodlawn too. We're shooting for the stars here. I mean, we think we can have something that could be a model. Uh, for the for the country, actually. Shooting for the stars, starting from the ground, revamping Security Square Mall. In Woodlawn, Amy Lou, WBAL TV 11 News.